A new book claims that Prince William reached out to Prince Harry following a worrisome interview when Harry rejected the offer to meet. Harry admitted in the interview that his relationship with William was rocky, a detail that worried William greatly, the author shares. Prince Harry admitted he and Prince William had good days and bad days in his new book, Courtiers, The Hidden Power Behind the Crown, Valentine Lowe wrote about how Prince William tried to connect with his brother but was snubbed. In the documentary Harry and Meghan, An African Journey, Prince Harry admitted to ITV interviewer Tom Bradby that his relationship with William wasn't in a great place. Harry and Meghan both shed light on the struggles of living in the spotlight in interviews filmed during the Sussexes' 2019 tour of South Africa. When asked about the rumors of a rift, Harry answered, part of this role and part of this job and this family being under the pressure that it's under, inevitably, you know, stuff happens. Prince Harry continued, but, look, we're brothers. We'll always be brothers. We're certainly on different paths at the moment but I will always be there for him and, as I know, he will always be there for me. He admitted, we don't see each other as much as we used to because we're so busy, but I love him dearly. The majority of stuff is created out of nothing. Harry added, but as brothers, you have good days, you have bad days. Prince William reached out to Prince Harry after seeing the interview in a book excerpt published on the Daily Mail website, Lowe recounts the details of William trying to connect with his brother but Harry ultimately turned him down. William, home after the Pakistan tour, appears to have been taken aback at such a stark portrayal of his brother and sister-in-law's unhappiness. He realized they were in crisis, Lowe wrote. The day after the documentary aired, William WhatsApped his brother to ask if he could come and see him. This put Harry and Meghan into a spin. What should they do? The author continued. Harry rejected the secret summit with William, telling him don't come initially, Harry was in favor, Lowe noted in the book. Then he spoke to his brother again, and asked him whom he would tell. William explained that he'd have to clear his schedule, which would mean telling his private secretary. At that point, Harry told him, don't come. According to Lowe, Harry worried that the secret meeting would make headlines. He was so concerned that William's team would leak the visit to the press that he would rather not see his brother than risk it getting into the papers, the author noted. To everyone who knew what was going on, this was heartbreaking. Lowe pointed out how this upsetting turn of events illustrated dysfunction among the royal family. It highlighted the dysfunction at the heart of so many royal relationships, and how members of the royal family so rarely pick up the phone to speak to each other directly, he wrote. Instead, they communicate via the apparatus around them. And the result is mistrust and division. Colon body language expert analyzes Prince William, Kate Middleton, Prince Harry, and Meghan Markle's reunion, brothers taking baby steps to heal rift.